Well, this morning I need water for plants and my hair. I have enough drinking water. <sighs> so the only way for me, oh, is it going in? I put it on. This is a 20 year old RV. So I'm trying to, there we go. Hold on, let me put a rock. Okay, in. so what I did was I turned the knobs to winterize, and then there's a little knob I pull up, and it will drain the tank. The water that I had in there was from when I tried out the old water pump, which didn't work. And so now I'm glad I didn't drain the water out earlier, because I sure could use it today. Because that means I don't have to go to town tomorrow, and I can go on Friday. So these older RVs don't have an efficient system. So here's the uh, here's the settings. Yeah. What a beautiful sound! Water in the desert, right under my nose, right under my bed. The real video was me, my first attempt at this. As you can see all the water and you can't hear the swearing and the stickers I knelt in and you know, that was the good stuff, but I just didn't think it was gonna have any content. Just getting water, who knew? Ow, I had to stick a funnel in it though because it was, it was dripping through the rusty undercarriage. I wouldn't drink this water, but I would certainly use it for dishes and hair and, well, actually I, I only use filtered water for hair, but the next two days, no, I'm going to use this. I am all caught up in this. Ah, I didn't know there were little thorns on this one. Oh, shoot. Hold on. Yeah. Forget ambiance. Ow! Oh, <laughs> it hooked again. Okay. You know what? I'm out. The scarf is going to be ruined anyway. I just spent... Three minutes picking it out, and then I stood up and it all whipped into there again with the wind. Okay, I am going to... Let me get out of this thing here. <laughs> let me keep going. There we go. I am going to rewalk the lot. This, I, 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 I'm going to call it a lot because land is like... It's, it's Tammy land, but it's really my lot on her land. And land just sounds like it's big. And it's really just uh, a lot to me. And um, on beautiful land. So I'm going to call it a lot. My lot. My lot in life. Finally. I've got my little lot. Um, the spot that we had originally picked out um, was not actually on the land. So I'm going to... I did a walk the other day. It was really windy, so I didn't record anything. But I'm going to go down there now because it's really calm I think so it won't be annoying when and I there's like three spots one's close to the road and then a little farther away and then one deep in the corner so we'll see which one um makes sense there's a little lizard okay gotta go I'll it's see really kind bit. of fun to explore and look and think this is where I have some roots or I can put some Arizona roots down and put some of my things that I won't have to take with me. I'm going to be, I'm, obviously I'm not going to stay here. You know, there's three, four months out of the year that, and maybe five, <laughs> that at this time is not livable for me uh, or dockable. It's not dockable for me, but I'm going to go stake out my lot for my tiny home building, and my storage. It's going to 
would be somewhere right around there. Not too close to the house. Going on a walkabout? I'm going to, uh, can you turn that off for a second so I don't yell into the phone? Because I yell into the phone. Oh, yeah. And then I have to change the audio. But no, I'm going to um, go look. I found the corner stake. Did you know that? That one way back there. Oh, good. So there's a spot way back there. There's a mid spot. And then there's a spot really close to the road. So I'm going to kind of go stake it out today. <laughs> stake out day. Cool. <laughs> yeah. Can I come over and watch and get the book in a minute? I got to take them a service. Whatever you want. Yes. Can I help them? Of course, I'm hungry, but I thought I wanted to work first. Here is the corner marker. That's the property line. And here is a spot that doesn't have very many uh, stones, rocks, whatever you want to call them. Someone called them basalt rocks, I think because then it's really thick right there it gets really really thick right there so you don't want to have to put in a road through that and destroy that beautiful rock formations so here see this look now i could plop that that construction word i learned let me turn around here so i can plop a construction I'm sorry, I'm not super with it right now, but uh, right here closer to the road so I can start bringing things over. But look at this lot right here. Look at this spot. This is like already clear. It's a little close to the road. So when their family's coming and going, it, you know, by the time you get your structure in and your road, Unless I, let me put it, beautiful, beautiful stones. Of course, I like to, I like to not disrupt the natural landscape as much as possible. But uh, the, the property line goes way back to those little, the, the grove, the grotto, I call it. So as I, if I can afford to put a road in, all the, which I can't, not right now. I mean, I can't, the only thing I can do is do storage, uh, which is like $30 container and start to, look at this, play with the land. This is rare. You get this much. Well, I mean, it's obviously, there's a little bit of a, it's not a heavy washout. Like right here, if you notice the green see that yeah so I I don't want to build over there because it's all I mean there's a little running when the when it rains it pours off those mountains and comes gushing down so without sharing too much of their family land and trying to keep this video just contained to to my lot just wanted to show you where I'm at today I'm gonna kind of mark it off this is it this is my lot the lot I picked out mm -mm, wasn't even on the land this one is close enough that I could I could move the rocks to get in some sort of a unit here but that's not going to happen I don't think before I have to leave for the summer I think I'm just going to get because I mean it, it March and April last year was it April it was it was too hot got hot really quick and who knows how long but uh yeah so this is it i'm gonna play with this right now i'm gonna bring my water over and start to form a little picnic area where i can come and talk on non-windy days maybe have some tea time tea time tales <laughs> yeah i got some tales for you i really do Any farther back would be too close to the house. So I'm going to choose to be right here.
this is the most efficient spot to get started and look it's not doesn't have a lot of cactus and stuff but I, this is going to be my little picnic spot I want a place to come right now because I'm really in the main camp and this is a place I can start to put a little piece of wood and sit down and have a little bin with water and my office <laughs> that's what it is I've got to get my office set up okay. okay so here's the before good look all these stones there's a cool one I see some up oh, here comes Kathy I have a visitor to the office my office isn't even open yet and I already got somebody coming shoes off test the lighting test the uh, I don't know ouch I did a sticker check these are the creosote remember I talked about those so they're uh... let's try this look at this little umbrella for ambiance See? For shade. Then I'm not battling that. So, I'm ready. Tea time. Tea time tales. What should I tell you? Let me look at my notes because I have notes for like six months, nine months, something like that. I was gonna I was gonna start recording, but another delivery. I got an apple on the way over here. And then Kathy's on her way over to help Mark with the construction and she's like you want some beef jerky and it's homemade beef jerky I'm like delivery so this is a great office because like it's this is my office I determined today lovely. isn't it lovely you're Not about everybody can be so fortunate you're about to be on YouTube is that okay Pardon? you're about to be on YouTube is that okay yes yeah, <laughs> oh. Hey. Hey. oh no I'm good I, sure. yeah okay. yeah yeah that's Kathy, bum knee Kathy. <laughs> um, also, Mark ran into a huge rattlesnake the other day over up some property he was at. And so just be aware that they're probably coming out now out here. The rattlesnakes are already out? I thought they weren't out until it gets hot. It's hot enough, apparently. I know, it's hot today. That's why I got an umbrella. And yeah, Mark's... Um, we were just looking at a lizard over there a minute ago, and he says, if it's hot, warm enough for the li lizards, it's warm enough for the rattlesnakes to come out. And he was over at that junk place. Okay. And huge. Um, yeah, I just saw a lizard in my camp this morning. So they're out there, snakes. Are... So just be aware of those. <laughs> well, I'm going to put up a sign that says, no snakes. <laughs> Do you think it'll work? <laughs> Bound to. I'm putting up a sign. If you say so, they won't come. Oh my god, this is so tender and juicy and... Does she want another? Mm -hmm. I do want another. <laughs> <laughs> I know, homemade is the, the bomb. Huh? That is... I feel like a dog and I'm going to choke on it. <laughs> oh. You have something to drink? Yeah. By the way? Yeah. No, I'm waiting for your next delivery. Okay. <laughs> Kathy, she's the inner office uh, runner. <laughs> right? <laughs> Bye. I'm going to finish eating this beef jerky. This is the most tenderest, most delicious beef jerky I've ever had. Um, I don't buy beef jerky because it's so dry. <laughs> so dry. Dehydrated. I'm going to finish this and then I'm going to talk about some things. Home, home on the range. Where the Burroughs and Joey are lame. <laughs> I'm not going to make up a song on camera. And I'm not posting this. I'm not. I swear I'm not. I don't care what I say. Or I don't care what you say. I got the umbrella to hang out by itself. So I can be two-handed. I think the umbrella's coming down. Kathy's back. I don't know why. I hope it's more food. What do you got? Hold on. What does she got? She's got something. What are you? <laughs> and there's a chair. 
Wait a minute. That was on Tammy. That was on, that's Tammy's. That was on Tammy's land. Did, are those Tammy's? She said I could have them a long time ago and I've never gotten them. Okay, so Tammy, just, Tammy, if you're watching, um, I know Tammy's back at her house right now, so she's not it's even not here. not too far away if she wants them back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got my first furniture. This was, this was not planned, folks. This was not planned. And it's cute, too. <laughs> she said you could have these. Yes. This, can you see me? <laughs> Who cares? Look it. I have office furniture. <laughs> this is so great. Oh, my God. This... You know, if she forgot or whatever, then. She does She does forget things. She waves. You can use it for now. She wants whatever happens, happens. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. All right. Da, 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 da. <laughs> okay, I gotta, I gotta set this up. I got furniture. See, this is a sign. This is the right spot. It's a sign. Oh, I have another tripod, so I'm gonna take advantage of this tripod. That's what the tripod means. Oh, tripod. the talking tripod. Tammy <laughs> talking. was the first talking tripod. <laughs> I was wondering what you meant by that. Now I get it. She was so funny because she was recording the tripod in the trailer. And she's got the camera, and I'm down there, you know, working on the trailer. And she's like, no, right there. Right. And the microphone to the camera is like, right there. She's like, no, do it again. Do it. She's trying to order me around. I'm like, they can hear you. Okay, they can't hear me. but they So You're right the next talking to that tripod mic. was born. And How cute. You're, you're like number seven, I think. Ah, so look, Lucky number seven. So um, can you walk? Can you be a walking tripod? Yes, I okay. might fall down. I'm really good at it. So I'm going to show you a picture of this area because as we were, as Kathy and I were walking up to the road, we noticed that this is a complete circle. See that? Go slow, go, go, go slow, slow, slow. I'm going to have to dock your pay if it's done. <laughs> go really slow, really slow, slower, slower, slower. Yeah. See, don't, so don't yell at me for that footage, you know. I'll take a picture, but yeah. So Make him seasick. It's round. It's completely round, and I'll go up to the road and show you. It's like a, not a, uh, uh, not a, it's not a crop circle. It's a rock circle. So I'm thinking this was alien, th an alien ship landed. My relatives landed right here. So this is, this is also another sign. This is alien friendly, I think, because... It's rocks all over this, and I have walked all over this land, and there is no open, round, sandy spot. So, another sign. <laughs> cute. It's That's cute. good. And they stand out. Oh, the little white ones. Yeah, this is what she does. <laughs> she picks up these pretty white ones and puts them in the lava, and then you know what I do? I go pick them up when she leaves. <laughs> <laughs> and put them somewhere else. And then I know I keep them. <laughs> no, I'm going to start yeah. doing that. Well, I have tons of them, you know, from first moving here and collecting them and collecting them. And then now I just like, you like, they're extremely unique. I'll just yeah, stick them on another that's a good idea. Rock. See, you can see the circle even better. So it's my rock circle. Yeah, that's, isn't that really, even you were surprised when we discovered it, weren't you? That's amazing. It's not anywhere else around. I know. There's no other circles. I wish I had a drone. Wouldn't that we be cool? You do? Mm -hmm. Cool. It's hard to use it because it's always windy. Oh, yeah, but I get up so early. I could drone it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'll talk to Mark. All right, Kathy has to go. She's actually her husband's assistant, and he's over there yelling at her like, hey. So she's, she's in demand. You know, it's hard to find good help out here in the middle of the desert. This... This just cracks me up. I was just going to walk down here and do a little talking head video, and now I have an office and furniture. I have a home. Home, home on the range. And that, I'll, I'll go over where I think I'm going to put. I'm just going to put that little storage shed and lay it down on its side right here. The one from, uh, you have maybe, probably haven't seen it yet because I haven't posted the... Uh, Maybe I have. The Tiny Home Treasure Part 2. But if I have, there's the storage units and they were really inexpensive. They're shipping, not shipping, uh, moving van kind of stuff. 
instead of it standing up tall like a big junky thing I can lay it down is that a good idea I'm full of them but back to work already made a mess I need to get some uh, plywood so the first order of business yeah let's mark this land let's stake my claim uh-huh do you can you figure out what I'm gonna call it anybody can you figure it out think about it I'll give you a second what do you think the name of my docking station is gonna be no, you're wrong. You're right. You're wrong. It's really hard to see out here, so hopefully I got it in there. Okay. Let's see if this works. Courtesy of Donna. I was supposed to give this back to you. I'm sorry. Ooh. Oh. Too much. Foo. How do you spell Fushu? <laughs> Fu? <laughs> Let's see. She. Wa. Fushiwa. Oh, God, I screwed it up. Looks like a half moon. She told me not to do that. I can hear you right now, Donna. Sorry. Fushiwa. There, it's like a big solid O, like a moon. A bigger F. I, I need some chalk. That's, a, uh, that's an ugly sign. Fushiwa. <laughs> but it's good enough. I, I think I do it with two O's, don't I? Because it's then it's Foshiwa. Fushiwa. Okay, I'm gonna go stake my claim. This is exciting. Might not be for you, but it is for me. So I'm thinking right in the middle of the circle. Right in the middle of my rock circle. Right here. Oh, my O is dripping. It's like a mushroom cloud now. Saddest looking little claim staker I've ever seen. And the happiest moment. This is good. I mean, come on. Apple, beef jerky, furniture. It's all a good sign. Because I've been all over this property starting last year. And now, where is it? I don't have my glasses. I can't even see it anymore. Nope. Okay, back to work. I love this new little tripod. See, then I can raise it. And then my head's not always cut off. I remember um, the angels, he was like, why is your hat always cut off? Well, it's usually because I don't have a hat on and I'm covering my gray roots, which is why I'm wearing hats all the time. But uh, it's also when I'm using the camera, uh, the selfie mode, you're like, okay, you frame it all up and then you say record video or hit video and then it like crops it and cuts your head off. So it's my camera's fault. It's not mine. You're the, my, our inner office runner. Come up with a better name for her. <laughs> they are the best. They are talented, friendly, considerate, generous, kind. Perfect, perfect neighbors. Speaking of neighbors, I haven't properly introduced Tammy, as many of you know, because it was, everything just happened so fast and I'm going to let Tammy tell her story when she's ready uh, because it's not mine to tell. But I will tell you that we met last year 
and we have been friends for a while. Um, but it's a year, a year and a half now. So she's not somebody new in my life and she knows me well and I know her well. This isn't a spontaneous thing. So um, I'll tell you that much and that she's the opposite of me, <laughs> which you guys have figured out. And yet we share similar passions, as you can tell on the treasure hunting part too. And so that's Tammy and that's, it's, I'm gonna call this Tammy Land and uh, I have a little lot here and it's good enough for now, but I, I suspect that I will want my own land because I will want my own five acres with, um, to legally purchase my own land so that I can have uh, retreats and um, workshops and places for people to come and get what it is I've done for myself over the last, I'd, I'd say five years. I mean, yes, everything, there's a lot of things I did before five years ago, but really five years ago, five, six years ago, is was the a real shifting physical location, um, physical, emotional, mental, spiritual testing of my beliefs. <laughs> Which, by the way, there, I, I believe them now. I you want to you want to test your belief system? Mm -hmm. I'll tell you how I did mine. It's a good story, and I have pictures to prove it. So. For now, this is my lot. This is my lot in life, right here. It's beautiful, peaceful, and I'm going to share as much of it with you as I can. And then I'm, because the channel, I love it. I love making videos. I love capturing content. It just shows up for me. It literally often shows up. Before I, I, I like mentioned, I said, "Hey, do you have like a little folding table or something I could borrow?" And then. Next thing you know, furniture is delivered. You gotta be careful what you ask for, right? I was gonna tell you guys a story, but just this overwhelming sense of peace and quietness came over me. So I'm gonna spend the next hour or so being still and being quiet. And I'll tell you a story another time my tea time talking head tales <laughs> yeah, I keep adding the teas first it was tea time then it was tea time tales now it's tea time talking head tales so oh, you're over here tea time tilted tea time tilted talking head tales there you go coming soon to a channel near me uh, I better I'm gonna have my come on you're getting me all excited again I gotta have my zen moment quiet, my peace.